Hi all and welcome to this video. My name is Susan and I'm an artist and a creative and today I wanted to give you a tip which is very much a mindset tip when it comes to sketching and letting go of perfectionism. Now today what I've done is I've gone through, went through my studio and I've had a little bit of a clear out. Um, I'm constantly buying new art materials, new sketchbooks and so I thought that it was time to have a clear out and actually what I'm going to be doing is throwing away these three sketchbooks. Now the reason I'm throwing these away is because they are older sketchbooks where I'm not particularly emotionally attached to them and also these were experiments, they were marks, this has got some scribbles in, my daughter did, I don't even know what that is, some experiments with watercolour, I don't need these. And I think it can be a really great thing to do to just let go of perfectionism by just throwing away some sketchbook pages or an entire sketchbook like this. What I have done with this particular one is I've torn out the back pages that were blank and I'm saving those to reuse, but the whole sketchbook is going in the bin. And doing this, tearing out a page in your sketchbook and tearing it up, is a really great way for you to just let go of perfectionism. Nothing is that special. I can do another pencil drawing. Here I was doing some um, sort of affirmations and things. Again, I was playing with watercolour. I can tear it up. I can throw it away. This is sometimes a very, very scary, but a very, very helpful exercise to do. This sketchbook, for example, was one, um, this was some planning that I've done for some lino cut prints quite a few years ago, and some brush lettering exercises. So these are all just experiments um, with brush, let brush lettering. Yes, there are some blank pages in here, but this sketchbook, I'm letting it go. Um, this is an older sketchbook, actually, and it's to do with the theme of dance. Um, I did some sort of sketches to do with movement, um, I studied some different artists and stuck some photographs in and pictures and these were some studies towards again some lino cut prints and, and various different pieces. Again this sketchbook is going in the bin, I'm going to let it go. I don't need this, I actually need the space, I'm moving forward to create new sketches and I'm letting go of this past. Now I'm somebody that does like to hang on to sketchbooks, but every now and again I do like to tear out some pages and just let go. It's not because these are bad or they're wrong, I just think it's a really great exercise for you to move forwards to let go of the past and not be so precious about things. When we're constantly moving through new sketchbooks and letting go of old ones, there's this progression and there's this excitement in your art practice. So do you have any sketchbook pages that you can let go of? Do you have any entire sketchbooks that you can throw in the bin? Any pieces of art you can rip up today? Not because they're bad, not because they're wrong, but because you don't need them in your life anymore. You need the space more than the sketchbooks. And actually what you perhaps need is an exercise in letting go of something. Nothing is that precious. This is just stuff, this is just sketches, okay? Um, a, a interesting one today. I hope that's very useful for you. So let's see if you can throw away some sketchbooks as well. Mm -hmm. 